Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm Jenny. Today's video is going to be my second project pan update video. Not gonna lie, I haven't used a lot of these um, <laughs> in a very long time, but I did want to go ahead and give you an update, so let's go ahead and start. Okay, so first is the Physician's Formula Touch of Glow Concealer. I am very, very close to being done with it. As you can see, it's all the way up here. Um, I do use this on occasion. I'm hoping to have it done by December. I really do think that it'll be done by then. Same with the Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. I am very, very low on it. I'll probably finish this up toward the end of November, beginning of December kind of-ish <laughs> when I start to lose the color because this is pretty brightening. Um, but I definitely will be able to finish this up as well. Uh, the Smashbox Camera Ready BB Water. I think I have like one and a half uses left in this. The Rimmel Stay Matte Translucent Powder. I have made quite a bit of progress on it, but I don't think I'm going to be able to finish it up by the end of the year. I do have some really, really good progress on the Wet n Wild Press Powder as well. I have started to get a little more pan to show on the tail end of this powder. I don't know that I'll be able to finish it though. I have made a lot of progress on the Wet n Wild Cover All Powder. A lot more of the pan is starting to show and it's starting to crack along the edges, so I may just end up throwing this away because it is starting to fall apart. I've made quite a bit of progress on the e.l.f. Contour Powder as well. You can see the like square portions of the pan popping through. I'm really, really proud of myself with this. As you know, this is my favorite contour shade. I also have the Makeup Geek Blush in Spellbound, which it doesn't look like I've made a lot of progress, but this is kind of like the only blush I've been using for the past two months. There is a pretty nice dip, but it's not anything crazy. Next is the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer in the shade Bronzer. Same with the blush. I've made a pretty nice dent on the inside but I, I'm not close to hitting pan at all on it. The Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette I've actually done a lot of good progress on. I've hit pan, like big pan, on the white shade. I used this to set my under eyes, and then the contour shade I've used more for bronzing, um, but I've hit pan on it as well. I'm really, really proud of myself with this product, actually, because I didn't think I was going to hit pan on either of them. I also have the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Waterproof Bronzer. As you can see, you can kind of see the grooves of the pan, but I haven't quite hit pan yet. <sighs> and the last product is the NYX Happy Birthday Eyeshadow Palette. My goal was to hit pan on one of these two matte shades. I've done pretty good damage to this kind of like nude shade. There's a very nice dip here, but I am not close to hitting pan on any of these and I'm most likely not going to. I already know I'm not going to hit pan on any of these eyeshadows, but I'm going to give it my fair shot until the end of December. But once it hits first of the year, I am going to pass this shadow palette on to a friend because I do think that she will enjoy these shades and use it way more than me, but I am going to give it my fair shot. <laughs> So I know this video is pretty short, but I did just want to go ahead and give you an update on all these products. The next video is going to be either at the very end of December or the very beginning of January because I do really want to give these products my all and I want to try at my hardest to either hit pin or finish these products up because I really want to move my collection along. As you know, I have a gigantic makeup collection and I need to get older things out of my collection uh, as soon as possible. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell down below so you'll be notified when my final project pan of 2018 video goes live. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you would like to subscribe, please feel free. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.